Hey guys, what's going on? Greenville Gear. Uh, thanks as always for tuning in. I think it's been a little while. I was running around this summer and I'm um, happy to be back at the card desk and um, sharing videos. So thanks uh, for all of you who've been watching my stuff. I watch all of yours. I try to comment and like and all that stuff. Uh, and so appreciate all the content out there. It's just been awesome in the hobby. Um, but I am back and today's video is to show you some slabs that have come in this summer. Uh, that I've been collecting. I'm excited to show those to you. I got tons of more videos coming up. Uh, I basically have been hitting lots of card shops and picked up a bunch of stuff online. Um, I've got a PSA submission order coming. I'll do a separate video for that. Um, I've just got to go through those cards. Um, just tons of stuff to show you. So I'm excited about that, but thanks as always for I'm watching. Appreciate it. Let me show you a couple slabs first that actually just sold um, last night. You know, I I sell cards so that I can buy cards, basically, uh, and and just to kind of keep collecting. Um, so I did a big SGC order probably last year, and two of the cards that came back were, were 2018 Series 1, uh, and it was a pair of SGC 9s, a Jack Flaherty and a Walker Bueller. I just had a blast before the grading prices exploded going through cards and those kinds of things. So I, I actually bundled um, these cards as a lot. And um, so those just sold. So they'll go to a good owner. Um, and so those are out the door and I've got to get those packed up. Here's the stuff that um, came in um, that I picked up over the summer and that I'm excited to show you. Um, first is an Alex Verdugo. 2018 Topps Chrome. This is the Refractor. It's an SGC9. And um, I just love this card. I think it's beautiful. I have above my desk, I have this 10, which is the Topps Chrome base. But I'm a sucker for the Refractors and the Shine. So I thought it would be cool to pick one of these up. So I got this in a 9. And it just looks awesome. So anyway, that one I got picked up and you can see there. The refractor designation. So I really like picking those up. So that was the first one. Um, a card that I didn't have that I uh, picked up this summer, which I was excited about, uh, is also from 2018 uh, Tops, and that's the Juan Soto Tops Update Rookie. Um, I got this in a mint nine, and I just, I mean, I just think that's a beautiful card. It's a beautiful pose. I love the red and blue. It's just awesome. So really excited to add that one to the collection. Similarly, I'll show you another one that I didn't have in my collection that I felt like I needed, and this summer was a good time to buy, and that's the Ronald Acuna Tops update from 2018, and I picked this one up in a PSA 9. What a cool pose as well. They're just a couple of beautiful cards, I think. Um, and, you know, with Acuna being hurt, um, you know, unfortunately for him, um, but his price has got a little more reasonable, so I was able to grab one of these um, and excited about that. Uh, similarly, a card that I had, and I think I had sold it raw, but I always kind of wanted it back, was the 2019 Eloy Jimenez rookie. And he is back now, and I got this, uh, again, at a bit of a bargain. So I think I'm getting a little better at timing when to buy players and, and those kinds of things. Again, not, not for investment, but just this is just a card that I wanted in my PC. So um, I think I'm getting a little better, um, at that. I mean, I can't get them all right, of course. Um, and tons of things I should have bought a long time ago. Now that prices have exploded or out of reach, but, um, getting a little better, um, at finding a bargain here and there. And that makes it kind of fun. Um, the only football card that I'll show you is, uh, my man Gardner Minshew, uh, who is no longer with the Jaguars. Um, but, um, I think he went over to the Eagles, if I'm not mistaken, you can correct me in the comments. Um, I just thought this was a really cool, and this is 2019, um, Donruss. This is the press proof red. It matches that practice jersey. Just think this is a gorgeous card and got it for a steal, of course, because Gardner Minshew is probably at best a backup, but of course he went to Washington State. Um, I'm a big fan and uh, Washington State had a rough opening to the season last night, losing to Utah um, State. That team is kind of in, in uh, disarray right now. Uh, two more uh, baseball slabs for you to show. 
Another guy that I collect on the Red Sox in addition to Verdugo uh, is Rafael Devers. And any anytime I see his base 2018 tops uh, rookie at a good price, I almost always will buy it. I, I should go through the ones that I have and I should weed them out a little bit and, and maybe sell a couple uh, to make some other buys. But um, this is a 2018 tops. This is the number 18 Devers. This is in a 9.5 SGC. And uh, just really like this card and can't get enough of it. So like the Verdugo, I've got it in the paper and I've got it in the Chrome. And uh, like I said, I, I should probably go through those and make sure that I don't have duplicates or something laying around. And then the last card, it's kind of a success story, it was a card that I sold raw that I had picked up in his early days of his career. And it was really chewed up. It had some bad edging and so on. And I advertised it as such. And I, I sold it raw and somebody picked it up. And um, I always kind of wanted the card back. Uh, and it's this one. This is the 2017 Bowman Prospects, first Bowman, Ronald Acuna Jr. And um, so I kind of thought, geez, at the price point that I had sold the raw one at it, I don't think I would ever get it back, but I got it back. And I felt like it was a good price. Again, Acuna's prices maybe were down for a little bit. Um, I haven't looked lately, um, but I picked this up. It's an SGC9 and was just really happy to get it back, basically. Obviously not the same one, because um, this actually, I think, graded, or, or certainly the one I sold wouldn't have uh, scored a, a 9, but just really stoked to have it. So that's going in the PC and um that's that so um those are my slabs i've got a couple of others um different sports and so on um but i think i'll do some separate videos for that um so coming up i've got lots of videos random pickups i've got like i said a psa uh, submission reveal uh, my cards with my buddy pete's cards and um some other things and some sets that I'm working on and, and that kind of stuff. So thanks as always for tuning in. Really appreciate it. Um, I hope you're having as much fun in, in the hobby uh, as I am and finding uh, new and fun ways to collect. So um, thanks for watching and I'll see you on the next one.